Bonfire here, back again with another episode of a bit of I'm sorry and a bit of everything is going on crazy with my life. But yeah, I know I haven't updated a video. I, I know I should have put a whole bunch of videos up by now. It's been a while since I've actually put anything on my channel. But I want to show you guys right now, this is freaking awesome. Like, holy virtual pets right now, guys. I really don't want to curse on my channel. I mean, I've done it in a couple videos, but I'm, I'm trying to get cursing out of my life. But anyways, you guys look at this channel right now. This is my channel right here. I, of course, I need to change it up a bit so it looks a bit better and a bit more organized or whatnot. You guys see we have a lot more games to go through today. I gotta get through all those games. I gotta make sure they're all updated. Make sure everyone's uh, fed and good to go. We have 40 subscribers. 40 subscribers! 40, guys. <laughs> like, I was not expecting to get this many. I just happened to look at my channel today because I know I hadn't uploaded stuff in a while. I've been streaming mostly and just stuff has been going crazy in my life right now. But I have to say thank you to all of you guys right now. So we got these 40 subscribers right now. Um, Oh, my. The first person right there. I'm very sorry for mispronouncing that because I am not going to even try and say it. I don't know how that, that's said. Thank <laughs> you for subscribing. I don't really want to screw that up. Sparks, thanks, you man. You are... Amazing for subscribing to my channel. So you have 1k subscribers. Just thanks for subscribing to me. DP, thank you for subscribing to me as well, man. Uh, Lin Lenorva, I believe it is. Lenorva or Linorva. I don't really know how to say that. I'm sorry if I'm screwing it up. But thank you for subscribing. Anthony Romo, thank you, man, for subscribing. CCUU2, thank you, man, for subscribing. Lucija Sobankian, I want to say. Sobankian or Sobakan. I don't want you to screw that up again. I'm sorry, but thank you for subscribing. Ember, Phoenix, Anatheria, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. Pet Simmer, Julie, thank you for subscribing to my channel. I see you have 401 subscribers. Thank you very much for subscribing to my channel. Angie, thank you for subscribing to my channel. Angie Robinson, thank you for subscribing to my channel. Kenya Chappelle, I want to say it is, or Chappelle, one of the two. Again, sorry for screwing it up, but thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. Swedish, thank you. I want to say it's Swedish. It's it looks Swedish. I'm I'm sorry if I'm screwing it up. Let me know if I screwed it up. You can toss it in the comment section down below. Say hey, one fire. You screwed up big time. It's actually pronounced this way, and you should say it this way in the next video. I will make sure to I will make sure to get that for you. <laughs> thank you very much very much for subscribing, man. Uh, Felipe LPV, thank you for subscribing. I see you have 364 subscribers, so thank you very much for subscribing to my channel. I will make sure that you guys are getting some more videos. HPA email, thank you for subscribing to my channel. Wolves76, thank you for subscribing to my channel. Thank you guys very, very, very much. Kylie, Larson, Damian Runestein, India Gaming, Alushine7, Esther J, Esther J, or Esther G, I'm not sorry. I, 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 I am sorry. I just don't know how to say it. I don't know if it's J or G or J. I don't know. It's kind of confusing. Let me know how that's said in the description down below. Guys, let me know if I'm screwing up your name, please. Dark Sharni, Seferian Faron, I want to say that is. Chaos Awas, Jesse Dyer, Kira Costa, Costad, I want to say Costad, yeah. Q Pets, Andrew Turner, Cloudy Kitten, Nether Sword 186. Power Monkeys, Daryl Thumb, Timeless Dream Self, Sparon, Doomax Desire 94, Burnout 935, Torium, Kyle Walker, and Indica. I want to thank you all for subscribing to my channel. Thank you, thank you so much. We have 40 freaking subscribers. It's just crazy. So today I am going to make sure that everything gets updated. You guys know what's all going with all my virtual quick games. You guys will know what is also coming up. Within probably this week or next week, I'll, I'll try and get some stuff going. I'm really, really sorry, guys. I'm mostly just streaming lately. You guys can all find me there. Of course, twitch.tv, uh, I believe it's backslash or forward slash one of the two, one fire, J-A-U-N-F-I-R-E. You can find me on any game underneath that username. So let's go ahead and get on with today's episode. I want to show you guys today the music that I'm actually going to go through because things have been getting flagged as copyright and... I just don't want to like get my channel shut down. So today we're gonna to use uh, free songs to use. This is this new channel. Make sure to put him or uh, this dude or 
this girl's channel in the description down below. I don't really know which one it is. Maybe it's a dog writing the music. That'd be kind of cool. It's a dog like pushing down the keyboard, writing the music. Anyways, this is the news person I'm subscribed to. I was just looking for some free music to use. That way it's not copyrighted and I don't get my channel shut down because YouTube has gone in completely insane with the copyright laws or copyright, um, I don't know, thingy for their website, however you want to say it. Anyways, let's look at what type of music you got going, because I saw you had dubstep. I think we might go with the dubstep today. We have, of course, house music, hip-hop, random, and dubstep. I can't wait to see what all you come out with, because you got a good, what, like 400 videos here? I don't really know. I can't really see. It looks like a good 400, 500 videos. We're going to go with dubstep today. Go and play some music. And make sure to put your description down. Make sure to put your channel in the description down below. So let's go ahead and get that going. Let's go and pop the volume just a little bit. No, no, volume's all the way up. So let's go ahead and get on with today's episode. Of course, you guys. Oh no, I messed up. Hold on, be right back. All right, got that back up and running. We put free to use at the bottom of the thing this time, so you guys get to have the music throughout this entire thing. But yeah, these are the videos. I'm not gonna show them all off. You guys can go and check out this channel because it will definitely be his or her channel. I don't know who it is. Please let me for know free to use. Are you a guy or a girl making this music? That way I know which way to call you. Anyways, this is the channel we're using for music today. And let's go ahead and get on with our uh, little things here. I don't know why this is the first page I come to, but for some reason this is the first page I come to. But let's go ahead and fix that, shall we? Bopping over here. Of course, this is our list of virtual pet games. You guys know this is my channel. I was planning to become the virtual pet master. Of course, I can't really do that now because work's got me. Life drags me everywhere. And then I got this and that going on, which drives my head insane. But anyways, we have this virtual pet list. We have been through the A's. We have been through the B's. We have been through the C's. And we are currently on the D's. As you guys remember of my very last... Uh, week type thing going on. We were with Draconis Theory. I did not finish that. And I'm very sorry, but I won't be finishing that one because the game is sort of just it's I, I went ahead and finish off the tutorial and it's not really a game that's for me. But anyways, next up on that list is Dragon's Cave. Like boom right there. This is one of the games that I've been talking about for a long time in all of my weekly recaps, all of my midweek recaps, and it just it's it's one of the games that I freaking love. But We'll also be talking about that today because I did get another mess up. I didn't actually take care of the eggs that I should have taken care of last time. And, of course, they broke and died. Except for one. So, you guys will see that in this episode. But then I'll be talking about Dragon's Cave within the week coming up or whatnot. But, these are the games that are coming up. We also have remaining in the D section. Dragon Empire, Dragon Stable, and then we'll be moving on to the E's after that. So, I may do two videos this week. I don't really know. Just to say I'm very, very sorry. I will try my best. It's just my schedule gets haywire, and then it just it, it it drives me nuts. But moving on to our very first game of this um video. Sorry, I just saw green, and then I saw mushroom. Like, oh, what is going on here? But um, anyways, this is uh, Sidious. You guys all know about Sidious. I'm pretty sure you guys have all known about it because I'm freaking love this game for its. Uh, the pets, the artwork, everything is just completely and utterly awesome in here. Um, I'm looking for any, like, super news that might be going on here. Nothing I really see, but there is something about Rise My Minions up here. Rise My Minions by the Puppet Master. There's three likes, there is six comments. Let's see what the heck is going on here. Uh, Sludge Caps, yay. Puppet Master. <laughs> nice. Um, Sludge Enchantment Rule. Oh, these are the Sludge Caps. Okay. So you guys know all about the different pets in here. Maybe you don't. But let's see. We're going to go ahead and create a pet. So now there is a sludge version of the caps. Where is the caps at? The caps are... Caps, caps, caps. Caps should be up here, right? Maybe it's not a... Oh, they're probably something we got to, like, fight. Probably a new version of something we gotta fight. But anyways, we have four notifications! Let's go ahead and look and see what all these notifications are. April 8th um, has brought the item Mud Soup from my shop. Okay, but thank you for buying the Mud Soup, uh, Fairy Nymph. April 8th, uh, Fairy Tail has also bought the old boot from my shop, so thank you for buying the old boot. March 28th, it seems, your hot potato has gone no attention, so it went spoiled and moved on to someone else. The hot potatoes are kind of crazy. I don't really know what's all going on. Let's see, we had four. So one, two, three, and four. That is all for the notification. We're going to clear events so we have a nice, clean slate for next time. But as you guys know, my pets in here are awesome. 
We have Fireball 1 1, Syria, Blurp, Bons, Boblis, Bria, Halion, Jacola, and Shando. Now, Shando will have some information dropped on it be as soon as I get it from uh, Kaldore, or Cal, as you guys know her. We all know about Cal. She's the one who's been doing the WoW series with me. You should all know about it. Go ahead and check it out if you haven't before. If you, of course, you are a new subscriber or you're just new to check out this video, check out further down in my channel. There's a lot of stuff in my channel between Virtual Pet Games, Dragon Hunter, World of Warcraft, um, and I think a bit of Minecraft. It wasn't really much Minecraft because I'm doing Minecraft on my live stream instead. I'm creating a new spawn for my girlfriend's server. So all that stuff is happening crazily. But moving on from Asidious, on to our next game, Anatheria. Now, I didn't see any new news in here, so nothing new is really going on here. But we do have some money we gotta grab. I have a th got a thousand from there, another 1k. Collecting our interest, we got 82 from that. Let's go ahead and deposit all of that into the money. You guys know we still have only this much amount. Uh, that that 300k is gonna really kill me because under these professions we need a million, a million anathers to get one of these professions. But I don't know. We'll get it. We'll get it eventually. We're gonna figure it out. I'll figure out something to do in here because we also got it. We also have a profession that we're using right now. Um, I, I could go through them, but it'll, it'll take a bit in the video. But so we don't want to take too long in this video. So let's go ahead and move on to Animal Jam. You guys all know I did touch this game because it is a nice children's game to play. It's It's got a parent-based system and whatnot. You guys can all check this out. Of course, again, nothing's really going on. Let's go ahead and turn off the music a bit. Uh, falcons are here, so I'm guessing that's a new thing for all the members. You can become a falcon in this game. Congratulations for that. Let's go ahead and spin the wheel. Give us some diamonds. Come on. Give us a gem. Ah, now we're getting... Uh, Getting 25 of the, uh, what are these things called? I forgot what those things are called. What are these called up here? I think these are called gems, and then these are diamonds or something like that. I already know. But let's go ahead and shut off the sound, because everything is clashing right now. Where is the sound? Can we turn off this? There it is. There's the sound. Sound is being turned off. And there's different types of curses and stuff. There's some new stuff in here, I think. I think there's some new stuff. What's this? Okay, that's a different game. So you guys know the game that I love in here. But let's go ahead and drop by our house so I can get away from everyone else. This is our house here. All of my plushies back here. We have an awesome wall of plushies. We've got a couple hanging from the ceiling. we got a new statue. Uh, it's got the awesome ice cave. But you guys know the game that I want to play. You guys already know what type of game I love to play. And we're going to go ahead and drop by the claw. Let's get a couple. Let's do five tries today. We're going to do one. We're going to go ahead and move this over a little bit. We're going to drop it right here down the center. Come on, give us a plushie. We got a plushie on the first try. That is what I'm talking about. And it's a new plushie we got. So we're going to keep that little guy. We're going to do five tries, like I said before. Pop this one over here. Go down on this side. Come on, give us another one. Give us another one. Ah, no something that time. Nothing that time. We got three more tries to go. Let's go fully over to the right side. See if we can get anything off of this side right here. We got another one that is two down in this video. And there's another one I don't have. So we have a panda and a seal this time. Two left to go. Drop it down over here. Just random spots. I'm not even looking at the computer right now. Nothing up there. We got the last try right here. Of course, I'm going to toss it straight down the center. Move over just a little bit. Just a little bit. And pop it straight down the center. Let's see if we can get one more plushie for this. Nope, we can't. But that was kind of awesome. We got two new plushies. I'm going to go and set these guys up right here. Up against the wall. We have a new, We have a seal now. So we're going to set this guy up here. We have a panda. And pop this guy up here and turn him so he's facing the right direction. We got all these awesome, awesome plushies up here. We did get a couple more things here. Um, we got some mushrooms. Let's go and pop the mushrooms over here. Let's get out of this and pop the mushrooms outside. Drop the mushrooms outside by the mailbox, shall we? Pop the mushroom. Oh, these some giant mushrooms. And pop them over here then. Put them on the sidewalk. Get out. Oh, no. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> pop them over by the sidewalk. And then we're going to put the butterflies on the wall. You drop the butterflies. Where's those butterflies at? I saw the butterflies. Can we put this on the wall? Yeah, a little bit closer to the edge there. And boom. That should be good. We got all this awesome stuff now in our house. Maybe we can get a bigger one later on. I don't know. I'm not really spending any money on this game. But you guys see this. This is Animal Jam. This is the thing that I'm doing here in this game. If you guys want to send me some random plushies in this game, I will gladly accept them. Because plushies are something I just freaking love. They're adorable, they're squishy, and they're fun to have. I'm moving on from Animal Jam to Ewos. 
Now, in AWOS, you guys know what is going on here in AWOS. Things get crazy, according to all the pets and all the things that can happen in this game. So, you guys have probably already seen my den a few times in the other episodes, but of course I will show it to you guys again today. But we have a news update, so let's see what the news update is all about. There is now, in the depths of the massive landfills, sir, uh, serving all of A, there lies a place where you can visit if you can tolerate the stench. It's called Castaway Canyon, and a host of creatures have made this dump their home. So we've got some awesome looking ones here. Um, I forgot this one was called. I forgot what they all were called, actually. I haven't been here in a bit. But we've got some things that happened in here. A uh, swarm of token pets can be found lurking between garbage heaps in Castaway Canyon, making this the first adventure area where you can seek out pets like Oda, Seraphix, and the brand new Alaroos. 61 new pets have been uncovered in this strange new land, so you'll be quite busy trying to pick them all up. But worry not, there's, this isn't a seasonal location, it's permanent, so collect them at your leisure. If you sub, uh, if you submitted pets to our Castaway Canyon thread that were not accepted, you may use the designs for anything you please now. Most of the items you can find here are, of course, broken nets. Uh, John, this pro garbage bag, I guess. Broken disc, and it looks like a banana peel. <laughs> what didn't you expect from the trash heap? So it's mostly that. I mean, you, the, people think they'll get gold. Lovely. Well, maybe someone can turn this trash into treasure. Um, don't really know what that is, but there is a lot of trash over here. There'll be some cool things. Have you ever wanted a rusted breeding coin? The museum has a brand new collection of cast, brand new collection for Castaway Canyon. If you collect all ten items listed, you will have yourself a shiny or, well, a breeding coin at least. It may not be shiny. <laughs> so there's a new breeding coin here called the rusted breeding coin. I'm guessing it will like rust um, metal A's or something like that, I don't know. Here there are A's and there are A's, there are the different types of pets here, so that's the way they work. Uh, do you see all these garbage bags lying around? Well, one man's trash is another man's treasure, right? If you open a garbage bag and you'll find one to three random R1s through R100 items. Who knows what you could find, right? Maybe it won't be total trash. Do you like collecting monsters? There are 10 new monsters showing up in Castaway Canyon. Everyone wants their own toxic trash habby, right? That's kind of cool, little trash habby. Dead fish, and a trash bag. Okay. <laughs> hey, look at this! A new line art has perked its head in from the Castaway Canyon. The Smee has been, has been needing a, a bit of a facelift. So here's where you are going to take a little vote. What do you want to be the official line art for the Smee? Old or new? Leave your vote in the comments below. Okay. That's that's a moldy sandwich, an empty water bottle, a pizza box. Wait. Wait. Are your pets keeping these pieces of trash as fauna? So there's new fauna as well, which are basically pet pets for these games, which is still freaking awesome. Pet pets are basically plushies to me. Of course there are plushies in this game, but pet pets are still like plushies. Because they're cute, they're snuggly, and they're... Pet pets. They're pets for your pets. They're freaking awesome. So this moldy, uh, moldy sandwich, a water bottle, and a pizza box you can keep as pet pets. But I really, really like my rusted can. I don't even have to feed it, and it will never run away. So this guy else, this looks like there's also a rusted can. Well, I guess your pets have a kind of inclination that my snoodle does. Maybe they'll find that appealing. But honestly, maybe I should try to get him a real fauna. Looks like Slashbot is also back. So the slash bot is pieces that can be found all over the site. You have to get, I believe, a hundred of the pieces, and then a hundred of the parts. So there's pieces and parts, so like nuts and bolts, and there's like slabs of metal and whatnot. And you can get to create the slash bot. I haven't talked about the slash bot because I want to try and get one myself, and you guys will see what happens with all that. Of course, I have a couple, a couple of new things in here. Easter in. Uh-oh, time to wrap up Easter, so how about we finalize the winners? Okay, so there was an Easter contest, and I missed that as well. Doesn't look like much else is going on. Just a whole bunch of new pe new uh, new parts and stuff to go on. There's a uh, awesome raffle going on as well. But let's check out our notifications. I did see a couple things that were up there. So Rudy, shout out to you, man, for giving me a new pet, which is fucking adorable. Excuse my language. The Serbies are like the 
the gold of this game. Apocalypse, Apocalypse Howl Survey. Yes, I have been wanting to collect all the servings for this game, which is just freaking amazing. He's also given me one uh, red demon mask that has been placed in my deposit box. So let's go ahead and check out that demon mask. What a red demon mask. Can we wear that or is that... Yes, that goes into our wardrobe. So that is automatically going in our wardrobe. How many red demon masks would you like to move to your wardrobe? Wait, there was something else I could do with that. It looked kind of weird. It said, put an egg? Put an egg. To collect eggs from the field without the closet eggs though. Oh, okay. Oh, that must have been the Easter event. Okay, well, I probably should have done that. Hopefully I can still grab it and put it into my, uh... Can we still look at the... Can, can, can I go back to the deposit box? Yeah, okay, okay. Woo! And almost, that almost didn't work. Okay, let's go back to our wardrobe. We're gonna drop that in our wardrobe. Whoa. <laughs> I was expecting that from the music. <laughs> Hopefully you guys heard that. Let's go ahead and get these out of the way. One, a two, uh, a two, and a, a three. There we go. And there was world. Guessing there was a field. Um, no field here. But let's go ahead and check out my lair right quick. Come on, lair. Load up. We got ourselves a new Serby. So I want to show off the Serbies that I do currently have. So you guys know if you guys want to give me any of these. These are the cutest, darnest things on this website. AWOS has the, this was the best idea. Because you can name, like, all three heads three different names, or just name the entire thing one name. And I just, I love naming all three heads three different things. So, I try to get all of this going correctly, but... Anyways, I want to get all of these, uh... All of these Serbies from this website. We're going to go ahead and, uh, get this going. Okay, so I had to switch up the music a bit. Some of it was just going a bit, uh... Yeah. <laughs> it's going like that in my head. It is dubstep, but okay. M moving on. Here in AWOS, we do have all these pets. All these awesome pets, pets, pets. AWOS, and I don't have any Oz pets yet. But yeah, these are all freaking amazing. But moving on from AWOS into Beast Keeper. Now, the Easter event I didn't even try and go for, but that is there if you guys want to try and finish it up. I don't know... I don't know when it is. Oh, no. Hold on. Offer is available until March 27th. So that's over with. Let's go ahead and check out my pets that we currently have here. My pets. We have Nameless the Dragon. We have a few Griffins in here. Spirit, Egret, and Esmeralda. We have also more dragons coming up. Gilded CBR R2. River. I'm sorry. I couldn't make it. I couldn't make a robot voice out of that one. I tried to. CBR R2. 2R. Maybe, something like that. I don't know. You guys can have at it. Toss the comment section below how you think that actually went. Whatevs. Whatevs. We have River, our awesome blue dragon. Cloud Striker, our awesome blue cloud dragon. And we have Fire Fang, our awesome red cloud dragon. And we have another nameless dragon. Moving on to our Pumas. Rina, Billy, Koga, and Nimrod. All the exact same Pumas. Yeah. Ignore that. You didn't see it. Cockatrice, we have our overhaul and first frost and giveaways. Do I have anything giveaways yet? Nothing giveaways. I don't have any uh, repeated dragons, but we could also add more groups if we needed to. Moving on from Peacekeeper into one of my favorite games, Chicken Smoothie. Now, guys, I have not even touched this game since the last time we looked at it. So, which means that there's some stuff going on here, and I can't wait to figure out what it is. Today marks the eighth year since Chicken Smoothies first began. So, uh, there's some stuff going on here. There's a birthday present. There's a birthday dress-up. And there's a form quiz going on here. There is a new dress-up stuff going on with the eggs. Um, there's new store pets, so there's unicorn. Oh, alicorns, actually, because I'm seeing the horn. And the horn and the wings, so those are alicorns. And of course, you guys already know what I'm going to do with this. We're going to go and check out the, the birthday stuff first. So there's a like, adopt me, adopt me, adopt me, and get this item. So all the items, we've got party hats. There's a little eighth party hat. There's balloons, confetti all over the place. God, that's a lot of confetti. I don't even know what I'm going to do with that. I'm going to dress up one of my pets. Moving on to the first one, though. We can adopt six of these guys. Go ahead and create some names for me. And let's see if we get anything. There's no different ones, so we have to wait till they grow up to this, see if they become differently. We have presents sitting in here. We have seven of those. Uh, create names for me. 
Come on, let's see what we Oh my goodness, we got some lions. Oh, he's a cutie. He's a freaking cutie. Or is that a she? Would that be a she or he? Oh no, here in here in uh chicken smoothie, there's not technically any there's no um there's no genders here in chicken smoothie, so it could be a he or a she. I wanna call this little guy a he. I just wanna see what name do they put on him, because I might want to change his name. What name do they give you? Uh did they even give you a name? I know they had to give you a name. Come on. Uh, there's the owner, there's the pet ID. Pet's name is Red Severin. I don't know. Guys, think of a name for this guy. Please, someone think of a name for this little guy. He's cute as all get out, and I'm just going to explode from the cuteness right now. But we have more to look at. We have a whole lot more to look at. We have another present box here. We can collect 12 of these. Really going create some names for me. Uh, adopt me, and we are getting a whole bunch of chickens. My goodness, the chickens are real. Uh, we're supposed to get 12. Uh, 3, 6, 9. Yep, that's 12. Okay. It just, they put it in an awkward area. We got some candles going on here, so there's three of them sitting in here. And I'm sure, I don't know if any of these are rare yet, so I'm not putting any in my giveaway pile. But moving back to our very first area, Shabowski. We have to do this, guys. They are the dogs and wolves, horses and ponies, cats, butterfly wolves, rodents, second gen pets, hatchery, and other species. This is what I love about this game, is just adopting all the pets. It looks like we have monkeys this time, so we're going to adopt seven monkeys. Go and create some names. Do you guys look differently when we come and get you? Nope, we have to wait till they grow up to become different. We have actually two dogs this time, so we're going to adopt six of these black ones sitting in here. Adopt these guys, no difference, so we won't be able to tell if any of them are going to be the same or not. We're going to get some of these orange and white ones. We're going to get five of those guys. Create some names for me. Adopt those. None of those are different as well, so we have to wait till they grow up again. We have two horses as well. Let's go ahead and look at these horses real quick. We get six of these guys. Oh, I didn't even look at the names. I should have made some names on those so you guys can figure out which ones you want to name and whatnot. Go ahead and create some names for this guy as well. Adopt that. No differences again. Oh, wait. Maybe this. Nope. Nope. No differences. Now we have one kitty cat who has like a neon paw. I can't wait to see what this guy's going to be like. Hope we get like a skeleton cat, because I know there's a skeleton dog. Maybe we can see if we can get a skeleton cat. These are really cool looking. We have some more butterfly wolves. Ooh, we have a paintbrush this time, so these might be looking pretty cool. Let's go ahead and see what these guys look like. We're getting ten of those. Uh, no differences. I want to see some differences in these beginning ones. I don't even know why, but I really want to see some differences. This looks almost like the candle. Whoa, we get thirteen of these. Unlucky number thirteen, anybody. They're all going to be the exact same. Watch. Uh, no difference in those. Those are the hamsters. That hamster actually looks like the uh, the flame hamster I have. Oh, these are really cool looking. I can't wait to see what we get out of this. We get ten of these guys. I would love to see some more. Let's see if we can get some more of these guys. Cause okay, there's a lot of differences here. Of course, there's one, two, three, three of those, and there's one, two, three of those. Well, then two of these guys. That's different, and that one's different. So we'll have to see if they grow up to be different or not. But we got some eggs. Some more in the hatchery. We get six eggs. Oh, who's gonna be named a question mark? I think that's kind of awesome. Yeah, question mark as in what exactly is it gonna be? And that's it for chicken smoothie. Let's go ahead and check out my little layer that I got going on here. I don't have anything going on specifically, but as always, we have the wolves and dogs. We have three similar guys here, so I will of course be splitting it. Oh, we have a lot of these butterfly ones. Oh my goodness, I need to organize all these. By next episode, you guys will see them all organized. And of course, the other one I want to show off is our Neverland Kids. These are the PPS. If you guys don't know what PPS is here in Chicken Smoothie, it means pets that will basically never grow up. They will always stay little, little babies and be awesome as all get out. But these are all the cool, awesome ones that are pet pet or PPS. PPS Chicken Smoothie pets, not pet pets. There are pet pets in this game. And I can't wait to collect a few more of those as well. But anyways, these are the ones that are my pride and joy. Honestly, these are the freaking awesome ones. And I don't know if we have any rares in here yet. Let's go ahead and check out the rare folder. We have one rare currently. So that is Pop, our, I want to say, food bunny. I believe he's a food bunny. But yeah, he's a rare. Moving on to Dragon's Cave. Now, there's nothing really going on here except for, like, an, there was an uh, April release. I don't know why I have so many of those. The April release going on here. There was a new dragon that came out, so I'm going to try and get this little guy somehow, some way. Oh, going back to Dragon Cave again. I want to show you guys that I did mess up again. These are all of my dragons 
And once we get 50, we'll be able to collect even more eggs than just four. We only had one guy hatch, but it's an adult. This little thing is an adult. I was like, what? It threw me for a loop. Well, of course, there's breed, describe, release, kill, and name. Of course, I haven't described any of my dragons. But I do have three eggs that have been destroyed. And I probably need to get these off of here. These were, I believe, the Easter eggs that I was supposed to be grabbing. And I'm sorry, guys, they didn't get a chance to hatch. But I will be grabbing some more eggs. Not this episode, because, of course, I have to go through all my other games. But I will definitely be collecting some more. So there's notifications here in Egg Cave. There is a new thing for this site blog. Looks just like a whole bunch of Easter stuff. I'm not really getting into the eggs in this game, because if you guys look, I have 57 creatures. I believe out of 300 I can grab. How many eggs can I actually grab? Yeah, I can grab 301 eggs, but I'm really looking to get all, all 300 of those eggs. I want to see some of these guys hatch f first. So what I'm actually going to do for all these egg games and all these clicking games, I'm going to open up a hatchery on um, the Virtual Pet site. You know the Virtual Pet directory that we were talking about? I'm going to open up a hatch a hatch forum on the Virtual Pet directory. So I hope you guys will get a chance to actually take a look at that as well. Moving on to Ellsmore. This is the second version of Chicken Smoothie. So adopt. Let's see what we're going to get here in April. We have some awesome dragonflies. Oh, I forgot. I forgot. We can't, uh, we can't middle click these guys. So we're going to go ahead and adopt. Got some dragonflies going on in there. Uh, we got more badger direwolves. Can I put you guys into... Okay, so we can't put them in a folder when we first get here. We'll figure out something. There is a soap bubble dragon, so those would be kind of cool to look at. Well, those bubble dragons, bubble drakes. Those are rune dragons, bubble rune dragons. We have the painted compound chillowings. So we got a few different ones in here that looks kind of awesome as well. Uh, the cephid cuttlefish, which is a new category. I can't wait to see what those guys grow up to look like. We have the goldfish rune drakes. Can't see what these. I uh, can't wait to see what these look like either. Adopt, we have ourselves a folk art sea serval, which is going to be freaking awesome. Can't adopt any special ones this time, but here in the bazaar, the ones that are available for the special baubles that you have to buy with real money is the Ancient of Storms. And the prong foxes are back again for this month with an awesome, what is it, five pack? Two, four, yeah, five pack of uh, foxes. There's a little zebra one here. I think this kind of cool as well. But one thing I wanted to show you guys, when I popped in here, I almost exploded. Like, no, literally, I almost exploded when I looked at this. Go back another page, I think this will be last, nope, one more page. Uh, one more page after that, too. Okay, here it is. Boom, rare, 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 rare. Like, explosions all over the screen, guys. I wish I knew how to edit videos correctly. Let's go and look at the last page, see if there's any more back here. Another rare! Like, this is making me explode right now. This is freaking awesome. Like, I know there's probably even more rares that I haven't looked at, but these are a whole bunch of rares. I can't wait to see what they all look like. Maybe I'll give out some, just throw them at you guys if you guys want them. It's only if I have repeats, though. You know, like, I have two of these guys, so one of them won't likely be given away to someone else. Well, this is another pygmy. We have a lot of pygmies this time, which is just still freaking awesome. I think it was because of the Easter update. Anyways, Valley of the Unicorns. No new updates. But what I'm going to look at is the adopts here. So let's uh, pop up this egg right here. Adopt again. Pop off this egg, the starry egg. Adopt again. This egg right here. Adopt one more time. It's two seconds for every egg you get a chance to adopt. So let's see. I believe that was three eggs. Let's grab this one right here because that one looks kind of cool. And one more egg. Yeah, we're gonna grab this one right here. Oh, no, nope, we're, we're out of that. So maybe we can, like, how many did I have? One, two, three. Oh, okay, I grabbed five eggs. Well, good thing it was the last egg we grabbed. So we got all these guys to also sort out. Some awesome things here in the Valley of the Unicorn. But moving on from Valley of the Unicorn to Wajas. Now, uh, let's, I've logged in, and there is new, new updates. So, of course, I have to log in again. I don't know what's up with the timer on this game, but it's not too friendly, I can tell you that much. Uh, that's a bit loud. Sorry, free player, but that is, like, very loud for some odd reason. And, um, let's see. New notifications in my box. Hey, everyone, April monthlies are here. So there's new wajas for the monthly wajas. The new wajas for the monthly wajas. That's what I was trying to say. <laughs> and, of course, we have one notification in our inbox. Which probably means that, oh, Ninja is 
on egg hunt. Ninja is on egg hunt. Has sent you a flower. Okay, so we got ourselves another new flower. Click here to view it. Um, we got some more flowers going here. Our flower patch is getting pretty big. I actually don't know what the flower patches are all about, but there's some achievements I got. Um, can I see what the, I don't know what the achievements are. I'm guessing one's probably like the breeding that we did and the other one is the money. But anyways, oh, be careful when you pick this up. Uh, we're going to grab it. We are going to grab it. The item has been added to my inventory. All right. So let's look at our inventory and see what that actually was. What was like, ooh, new item. Whoa, we do have some eggs. Mystery humming can be heard inside. Easter egg, vagabond egg. Eek, this egg is sharp. Oh. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Nope. We're going to do that just yet because we only got one of those. I'm going to open up one of these guys instead. We'll open up one of these guys and see what we get from it. Are you sure you want to open this Easter egg? Kunaka! If you sure choose the number of Easter egg Gunaka you wish to open, click the submit button below. Note, once you've opened an item, it'll be gone and you cannot undo this operation. You'll receive whatever is inside. Select the number of Easter egg Gunaka you wish to open. Submit for one. Let's see what we actually get from inside of it. Uh, Flower Valley wallpaper. Okay, so we got a wallpaper out of that. Maybe we'll open up the rest of those in another episode. But what I wanted to show you guys is my awesome cave. Because there's something here in the cave I didn't show off last time. And someone said that it should be under... Oh no, here they are, guys. They're right here. This is the new... This These are the, uh, the puppies that we've gotten. So we got two males, which is freaking awesome. This cute little guy right here. Give him a name. Come on, give this guy a name for me. I want to know what you guys can name him. It's a cute little black wolf with a little flame going over his paws. But you got a second one here with red all over it. I want to change this one to a female. We have a gender pair, so I might just change this one to a female. That should be freaking awesome. But of course, they are siblings, so they cannot breed. But it will be awesome to see what actually comes out of those two. But go ahead and name this one as well. I want to give it a female name, so I'm changing the gender of this one to a female instead of a male. Just a, it, it looks more of a female to me. I think it's freaking awesome. But next time for when I do have eggs, what needs to happen is I need to be actually clicking on... Oh, we can grab another one of these guys. I'm just going to do it. It's happening. <laughs> we can click on Young Watchers because, there's, of course, there's no Young Watchers now. But Young Watchers is where the eggs would hatch at. Like, the ones that have been bred will put will spit their eggs into this section. But moving on from Watchers into DNA Adopts. So nothing's really going on here. Except for something like, uh, Welcome to V3? Don't really know what that's all about, but let's go and check it out real quick. Some announcements. Hello, everyone! We are now running on V3. Some things to note, everything should be transferred over except for the farm post. If you are missing an Epsilon item or Delta, please PM me. Any bugs you find should be posted on the help and bugs. Um, breeding is disabled until I transfer the lineage data from V2. This shouldn't be too long. Um, after that, let's see, we have the color shift files have been resaved as PNGs and not GIF. But they are safe and will be appearing shortly. Um, after that, let's see, the dorms did not transfer, but I can PM you the, the code to your old one if you want. PM me if you want this. Thanks everyone, welcome to V3. Well, okay, so they're in version 3 now of DNA Adopts. Can't wait to see what actually goes on there. But we are going to look at my Adopts. The ones that I call, or the ones that are in this site, are called Epsilons. These are all of my Epsilons right now. We have more on, like, the second and third page. Of course, ones that haven't been hatched yet, because you need to reach level 100 to actually hatch, which is going to take me a long time. Which is why I wanted to set up a view post, uh, click post on the uh, Virtual Pet website. But after that, after DNA Dubs, we have another awesome game, and you guys already see where I've made a mistake. I've let this game drop for so freaking long that I had to actually go and buy food, guys. I usually have enough food to feed all these guys, but I had to go and actually buy food this time. So, Break isn't fed, Hestia, Nightwing, uh, some of the ones back here as well, unnamed, unnamed. Um, there's a few of them I, I didn't get a chance to actually feed fully. But you guys got to sell my entire layer right there. I'm not selling these dragons. These dragons, if I don't want them, will be exalted. But I am a noodle farmer now. I actually love the freaking noodles, and I can't wait to see what those 
what what I can actually do with those and color sequences and stuff. So the noodles are the ones that I just freaking love and adore. I just can't wait to see what I can do with those. Um, there are also the, the nocturnes, which I have an egg that I want to hatch, but I'm not ready to hatch it just yet. Because I have these three nocturnes that just look freaking amazing. And the last ones I think I was going to go for was uh, the... Was it these guys? Or was it... Yeah, I think it was these guys. The Wild Claws. The Wild Claws and Coddles. Just to have some cool looking rare dragons. So on and so forth. Anyways, the guys... That is my episode for today. I know it's about 40 minutes long. And I hope you guys have watched this till the end. You guys know I'm freaking amazing. At least I know I'm freaking amazing. I hope I know I'm freaking amazing. Um, yeah. Anyways, <laughs> just to finish this off, I want to say one last thank you guys. Just holy virtual pets right now. Thank you all so freaking much. Like, 40 subscribers is insane. And I know I paused the music, but I really need to tell you guys, thank you. We've gotten up to 40, and I just, I can't wait to get further on. I don't have anything special planned for, like, the 50 or the 100, but I know I'll figure out something. I would definitely probably do, like, a giveaway on one of the virtual pet sites that I'm on. You guys know up next, the game is coming up, is Dragon's Cave. Um, if I forget anything, let me know in the comment section down below, because I will definitely make sure I get that within the next video, or do a short video on one of those games. But I thank you all. Just seriously thank you. Um, I know I haven't uploaded much, and I hope this gives you guys a feeling of letting you know I'm still alive! I'm still here! Please don't go anywhere! Yeah. I'm I'm awesome. I'm still here. I I'm creating more videos. I I know I can do it. I think. <laughs> Anyways, check out my Twitch, twitch.tv slash wanfire. Check out free songs to use if you guys want to use some songs within your uh, videos. Just check out all the songs he's got in here because he's got a whole bunch of freaking songs all over the place. Um, check out the virtual pet site, like the virtual pet directory dot com, I believe it was, because that has a whole bunch of virtual pet information and whatnot. And of course, check out every single one of those virtual pet games I've showed you. If you guys want to check those out, just make sure to like toss in the referral or the uh, the I think it was called mentor section. Put in my name J A U N F I R E. Again, guys, I am one fire. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. Thank to all of you that have finished this to the very end. I am now signing off <laughs> from the virtual pet dimension and the world of I am back. I will definitely talk to you guys later.